<laughs> they gonna be mad at me, boy. Oh boy, what? He hasn't put out anything today? Nothing? <laughs> they gonna be mad at me, boy. Oh, by the way, hello, viewers. <laughs> Mornings, another beautiful day. Yeah, hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good or excellent. What? All right. So you know, you, you know, you, you know, I'm gonna put some content out for you. All right. Let's see. What should I do first here? Oh, listen to this. Uh, GPU based shader simulates motion clarity of c a classic CRT monitors, courtesy of Blur Black uh, Blur Buster. Emulators could enjoy a new uh, renaissance in pixel perfect blur free gaming. Listen to this. Says in context, modern shaders are a sophisticated piece of code uh, capable of modifying real-time computer graphics with high precision. Some shaders can uh, render realistic game environments using advanced ray uh, tracing lighting effects while others can s significantly enhance simple minimalistic virtual uh, scenarios. Best known for their popular uh, UFO test uh, refresh rate tool, Blur Blast have unveiled potential game change in motion clarity and advanced graphics. Founder Mark R. 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 teamed up with uh, Timothy uh, Lotus, a former AMD and NVIDIA engineer, to develop a novel algorithm that simulates the behavior of CRT screens. This breakthrough technology is already being adopted by major emulated projects. The algorithm is designed to deliver a major reduction in motion blur on monitors with higher refresh rates. As Blur Blaster explained, anyone familiar with CRTs knows their ability to produce uh, shockingly clear uh, moving graphics, a quality of algorithm aimed to replicate. Unlike the traditional black frame insertion BFI methods used by other CRTs shaders, this new approach offers a superior experience with fewer eye strains and issues. It is especially effective for reducing motion blur in legacy 60 FPS, 60 Hz contents. However, there's a catch. The algorithm requires a monitor with a minimum re refresh rate of 120 Hz and no local uh, dimming lag. Then it says Blur Buster recommends 240 Hz OLED display for the best results with the algorithm, although it should also work well on a 240 Hz LCD display. However, the performance is expected to be uh, fantastic on a 360 Hz to 480 Hz OLED screen. The algorithm can reduce motion blur in both real time and slow motion scenarios, offering potential boosts for emulators and retro gaming enthusiasts. Says the real time version of the algorithm requires a powerful GPU and may not look optimal on all display. As Blur uh, Buster notes, your display motion blur reduction will be limited by the native simulated uh, hertz ratio. More hertz, the, the merrier. To demonstrate its effectiveness, Blur Blast uh, posted several demos on sh shader toys showcasing how algorithm performs on 120 hertz, 240 hertz, and 480 hertz monitor. The 240 hertz demo looks good. On my uh, QHD 240 monitor, though, I I do do I did love to compare it with my old CRT for true side-by-side -side tests. Then it says, uh, CRT uh, simulation has long been a challenge for graphically intensive emulators of classic consoles and PC system. With this new open source shader, the situation is set to improve quickly. So, uh, yeah, that's the end of the article. So, uh, you, uh, CRT, you, you are emulators and you CRT lovers? <laughs> I guess this is music. This is what you call music to your ears. Yeah, technology is always improving. So, uh, this should, uh, this, this should improve, uh, 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 mo uh colors, motion, everything. <laughs> On on older monitor on older monitors, or even on OLED, or even on even on LCD monitors or OLED. Yeah, so that should that <laughs> that 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 should get you all uh, excited for uh you know for for the for you for you emulators 
and you uh, of our classic classic games and old, older games. So yeah. Right now they got a picture here. This is a View Sonic monitor. I ain't seen one of them in years. <laughs> I didn't get and they got a picture of Half Life. Yeah. But they don't have a video here too to show the comparison. That's what I'm looking for. I don't see a video. They, sh they should have put a video in this article. That's what they should have done. Uh, let's see. Uh, nothing. Well, I'm gonna leave the article in, in the in the description box. But when you see the picture of this uh, View Sonic monitor, that 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 uh that game, the, the little game in the background, will uh will will look familiar. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this video for y'all to enjoy. Though. Nice talking to you people again, Chris. The Star Wars Dark Thing, Dark Side. Go. Peace.